Vince. The we just got to talk about that Kenny match. I'll get to that. That Kenny match was in freaking incredible. Yeah. I mean, the whole thing with that match um, is that you know you could tell from the the thing. Kenny Omega went in there with this idea that he was going to make a superstar in one match. And my God, did he do everything in his power to do so. I mean, this this was a great match, but it was it was a showcase for El Hijo del Vikingo. So they they got a guy who freaking I mean, like, you know, when Bandito had that match with Jericho and, and really tore the house down and got his contract. That was a big deal. This was this was so much more than that. This was, you know, one of the, you know, just an incredible, incredible performance by Vikingo, augmented by the fact that Kenny Omega was there to take crazy bumps for him. And that freaking Frankensteiner thing, you know, that delayed Frankensteiner spot where Omega landed on his, almost on his head from off the top rope, that was... That was pretty scary, and Omega's selling of his midsection because he had surgery is was so good. I mean, he just his facials and everything, and uh, man, everybody. I just saw people all night, and I was getting texts all night from people who normally don't text me about wrestling matches, and just just absolutely loving this match. And um, the guy, you know, Vikingo is not under contract to AEW, and I mean, he just. This was like Rey Mysterio's debut in WCW. Actually, it was even more impressive than Rey Mysterio's debut in WCW. But that's the closest that I can come up to, you know, kind of an equivalent. I mean, he just, you know, he he did some great, great stuff. The whole match was, the whole match was just incredible. And since Omega won, I'm going to presume that, you know, because Vikingo is the AAA champion, um, and the fact that AAA has been wanting this match for years. Um, him beating their world champion uh, would lead one to believe that there is a AAA world title match uh, that will be a rematch between these two coming up uh, at some point not in the distant future. By the end of this, I was convinced Iron Mike Sharp is the best wrestler who ever lived. He's low-key at first. like bah, 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 bah. But he keeps going. He claps. Bah, 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 bah. Yeah, I got a headlock. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Ah, I'm tall. I'm giant Mike Sharp. If you enjoy these videos for just $7.99 per month, you can enjoy full length editions of The Brian and Vinny Show, Wrestling Observer Live, Figure Four Daily with Tom Lawler and Lance Storm, The Mad Men Podcast, Speak Now Pro Wrestling with Denise Salcedo and more, plus hundreds of archived shows, all in beautiful HD. Don't miss out. Join us today.